Azure Gleam to war. It is the end of 1181. Two years have passed since the Officers' Academy closed its doors. After ascending the throne, Dimitri labors to bring peace to the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. With Edelgard ruling as the Emperor of Adrestia and Claude leading the Leicester Alliance, the three erstwhile schoolmates strike out as the next generation of leaders. A new era is dawning in Fodland, and much teeters at the brink of great change. The first tremors of a major upheaval rock the land as Edelgard declares war on the Central Church. Pardon my lateness, Your Majesty. You needn't worry, Felix. I know your duties are many. Though, I'm afraid we could not wait for you to begin the discussion. This is about the Empire's declaration of war against the Central Church, yes? Indeed. As you're aware, we have already begun accepting refugees from Garrett Mock. But a few days ago, I received a confidential request from Seteth asking us to protect the higher-ranking members of the Church, including Lady Rhea herself. Of course, we'd only meet this eventuality were Garrett Mock to fall. As it stands, we find ourselves quite literally stuck between the Empire and the Church. I'm not sure how much longer we can remain neutral. If I might, Your Majesty, Troubling as it may be, I believe it prudent for us to reject this proposal from the Church outright. Offering them shelter will only serve to provoke an invasion from the Empire. This matter of the Southern Church concerns me as well, but I believe we have more important matters to be fussing over at the moment. Your counsel is much appreciated, Viscount Elador, but I assure you, Things are not as cut and dry as you make them out to be. The mandate granted to the King of Fargus and all the lords who serve under him is given legitimacy only by the grace of the Church. Are we to renounce the very heart of this kingdom simply because we shudder at the thought of invasion? War will always come at one point or another and some degree of suffering is purely inevitable. You know this as well as I, Viscount. You dare speak of suffering, do you? When the blaze of war will not scorch your lands in the north as it does ours? I would normally agree that those of us from the northern territory should hold less sway in this discussion. But if Garrick Mach were to fall, the war fronts would not halt in the west. Your Majesty, what of House Roe or Galatea, or the others in the south? Not a word from Count Roe as it stands, but I did receive a missive from Count Galatea. It read, My people are not fools enough to rejoice in the surrender of their territories to invaders. There is no morality in turning our backs on the institution at the very foundation of our lives. We must support the Church, as they have supported us. Your Majesty, we owe a great debt to the Central Church for their role in quelling the uprising two years ago. To not repay such generosity in kind would risk weakening the trust of your vassals. And if that happens, we might find ourselves right back in the same mess as before. They lack the Crest of Blathid, but there's no small number of nobles who might crawl out of the woodwork claiming royal blood. The kingdom has already seen the turmoil and division such claimants can bring after the death of King Klaus. But Duke Frontarius, surely we are better served attempting to head off the very real and imminent war at hand instead of debating hypothetical unrest? I don't want my people to suffer the pain of conflict. But does anyone here really think the Empire will simply stop if we appease their every demand? Suppose we do let the Empire take the Archbishop. And suppose we accept this new Southern Church. 
Then what? I imagine the Empire plans to install the Bishop of the Southern Church, Count Varley, in Lady Rhea's place. I fear I've heard nothing good concerning either the man himself or his teachings. They purport to be an arm of the Church of Seros, but the Southern Church is nothing more than a mouthpiece for the Empire at large. In other words, rejecting the Central Church in favor of this new Southern one would be no different from flat-out accepting Imperial rule. It's hard to say just how they would treat our kingdom were such events to unfold. Though I imagine it would involve heavy taxation for the express purpose of bleeding Fargus dry and filling the Imperial coffers. Do you have something to add, Duke Fraldarius? Not really, no. I was just wondering how long we were planning to continue this tedious charade. The question's simple. Do we hand over our kingdom and subject ourselves to Imperial rule or not? I believe the Margrave has been quite clear as to what will happen if we give in to the Empire's demands. We've all been informed of the rapid reformation their region has undergone. Many aspects of which I admire, I'm not ashamed to say. But an old, stubborn land like ours isn't suited for such tempestuous change. Radical new freedoms are not what the people of Fargus need right now. They need stability, steady improvement in their daily lives, and real, lasting change can only come from a solid foundation. Sounds like your majesty has made up his mind then. Just say the word and we'll leap into action. <clears throat> the Holy Kingdom of Fargus will hereby offer asylum to the Church of Seros. Everyone, sharpen your blades and prepare for the battles ahead. Gustav, Dudu, make to ride at once. Our intentions must be made clear. Not only to the Church and the Empire, but to Count Roe as well, and all the other lords who failed to answer my summons. Understood, Your Majesty. Hey, did you hear? Sounds like we're gonna be going to war with the Empire. Yeah, I'm aware. Ever since His Majesty ascended the throne, we've been fighting battle after battle through every corner of Fargus. But I never thought we'd be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the actual Empire. I'd be nervous if it even felt real. Don't worry. It'll start feeling very real very quick once the sword starts swinging. You know, that might be the single worst attempt at motivational speaking I've ever heard. Not that I'm much surprised at this point. I can't help but wonder, though. What happens to Fargus now? I feel like things have been steadily improving lately, but not everyone favors His Majesty as I do. Yeah, I hear the grumbles too, but there's not a ruler in the world who doesn't have their fair share of critics, right? All I know is, we wouldn't be where we are now if not for him. I mean, look at me, saddled with some mysterious power we don't know anything about, and he still chose to put his faith in me. It's only right I return the favor in kind. Oh, and speak of the devil. Am I interrupting something? No, of course not. Please, allow me to take my leave. Your Majesty, Commander. So, you heard all that, huh? More or less. I apologize for the interruption, but there's an urgent matter at hand. Anything I can do to help? There is. As you know, we've offered asylum to the Central Church in their efforts to flee the Empire. As such, we are to escort the Archbishop herself to the Royal Capital at once. I expect heavy pursuit from the Imperial forces, so I am assembling a team of those I trust most to assist in the mission. Of course, I'll be leading my own regiment into battle. But I was wondering if you'd be willing to accompany me. What, is that it? I'd be glad to. 
How are things looking at Garrick Mach while we're on the subject? Grim. Neither the Knights of Seros nor the Monastery Ramparts are capable of holding off the Empire's massive military might. I dare say we have precious little time to waste. Prepare to deploy at once. <laughs> that reminds me. How tiresome. Good. Ugh. Let's see. So the story is. Can I serve?
Hey! You should hear this. Counting on you. May I speak with you? I have a request. May I have a word? Bye. Don't screw it up, okay? Indeed. At your service. How can I serve?
well? Right on! Well, how'd it go? Any results a good result. I've been waiting for you. How about this? There you have it. I implore you. carry a little of everything here. Hope to see you again soon. Welcome. Training can be the difference between victory and defeat.
I could never get results like this alone. With proper training, you'll be unstoppable. Which battlefield are you headed to? I'm ready. I'll cut them all down. Fight starts now. Glory! Begin the operation. Allow me to lend a hand. I'll do what I can. It's worth a shot. I'll do my best. I'm a little pray to the banner of the knights. Victory shall be ours. Yeah, we can win this. Hold of it. My turn. I owe you one. Not a problem. I've got this. Begin the operation. Our orders are clear. We're done for. The rest is up to you. I can still fight. We weren't strong enough. You did it. Oh, no, 
I can hold on. Help me, please. I'm glad to go. I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about this. Not a problem. I've got this. I'll do what I think is worth this fun for me. <laughs> Wounds are severe. I have to fall back. Now then, what now? No way we can lose! Wounds are severe. I have to fall back. Thank you, my friend. I'm a little nervous about this. Begin the offer. Our orders. Not a problem. I've got this. I'll do what I can. It's worth a sh Here I go. I'm sorry. We weren't strong enough. <laughs> to retreat is a vital strategy. Wounds are severe. I have to fall back. I can. It's worth a shot. Hey, this! You hit us! Let's carve a swath through the battlefield! Those enemies? I'll do what I can. It's worth a shot. Not a problem. I've got this. But defeating them all, too.
Leave this to me! There! You'll never win! Thank you, my friend. This should make a good foothold. Here I go! I'm all right. Stand down. Each win brings us closer to our goal. Step closer to my goals. I've grown a lot. I won't let this go to my head. I cannot grow complacent. This will help everyone out. How can I best use this power? We've determined the Archbishop's course, Your Majesty. She makes for the Valley of Torment. Then she's fleeing north, to Fargus. There is also, of course, a passage to Daphnal territory within the Alliance. But I surmise you are correct. She surely makes for the Kingdom. If Fargus has chosen to side with the Central Church, it stands to reason they'll mobilize their forces to escort the Archbishop. If they do rendezvous with her and manage to retreat to the Kingdom, our one chance will be lost. Yes. We cannot let her slip through our grasp. I will see to it myself that we don't. Your Majesty, I will need a squadron well equipped for pursuit if I am to accomplish this task. One such as the Brigid Hunters. Given our considerable losses during the suppression of Garrig Mach, a smaller unit would be preferable for this undertaking. Petra's unit? Very well. Take anyone you think could prove useful to your efforts. If we can capture the Archbishop, the tides of this war will turn drastically in our favor. Agreed, Your Majesty. As for you, gather the others. We must discuss what to do about the Kingdom. Right away, Your Majesty.
Okay. Come this way. At your service. Care to make yourself useful? Counting on you both. We'll handle this together. Let's do this, together. You have my gratitude. Hunger is the true enemy. Solid, solid. You made this. Impressive. Oh, I love this. Thank you very much.
well. What is it? Thank you. can leave this to me. Time to go. For House Frodarius. Understood. Cut through our foes. Leave every hear you loud and clear. I might just be able to help. Let's begin. It's time to move. We must act now. Let us see what we can do. Thing you have on this battle. Now, all units, move out. Onward to victory.
least more bitter than blackest poppy. I gotta face my comrades after this. Lend me your strength. Saint. No more. Allow me. Let's do this. Go away with this mother. Go together. Go get him, Your Majesty. Not your day, huh? You're helping too, sir. Stand Knowing when to retreat is... We will proceed. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Let us see what we can do. It's a vital strategy. Time to make a name for ourselves. Surrender! Let's begin. It's time to move. Let's begin. It's time to move. We will post. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. I hope it was enough. This is little more than a scratch. No mercy. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. The strategy. Can I face my comrades after this? By my honor! I will fulfill my duty! Are you watching over me, Labyrinth? I pray you continue supporting the king as gallantly as you once did my father. Surrender! Let us crush their defenses! I brought this stronghold to its knees. We must act. Let us see what we can do. We must act now, before the worry sets in. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. I've awaited this moment. This one's not it for us. I would appreciate some help. Success. Ready to go. This is not yet.
Perfect the time for celebration. We're done for. The rest is up to you. Knowing when to retreat is a vital strategy. It's time to move. Hear you loud and clear. I'll make short work of this. I'm going. <laughs> Wounds are severe. I have to fall back. It's time to move. I'll make sure. Stand back. I'll take I'll the no mercy. Allow me. Wait. Let's begin. It's time to move. We must act now, before the worry sets in. Let us see what we can do. Got you! I shall take the lead. Shall pay for this, you hear? Take this moment to bask in the joy of victory. This strength will ensure nobody dies a needless death. There 
there is little time for idling. I'm glad to be of use. This way. Please. Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. Let me know if I may be of further service. Time to go to work. I can depart at once. I can do this! Understood.
Let's earn our keep. I will not. I'll give it a thousand percent. We can do it together. Begin the operation. Our orders are clear. Let's begin. It's to let you die. We're at a disadvantage here, so don't get reckless. We need some help, and fast! Begin the operation. Our orders are clear. Let's begin. It's my turn. I'm going. <laughs> Let us take this stronghold. Again, it's time to move. Got it. Take a breather. Grant them no mercy. My turn. Again, it's time to move. Begin the operation. Our order. Gotcha. I'll cover you. 
I hope it was enough. Begin the operation. Our orders are clear. Not a problem. I've got this. This place won't be a problem anymore. This stronghold will fall! Begin the op- Our orders are clear. It's time I'm going. Retreat! Well, who's next? Fine work. I'm dragging the others down. Not sure how, but it worked. Not a problem. I've got this. <laughs> 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 Let's begin. It's time to move. Or allow me. Let's begin. It's time to move. Not a problem. Uh, <laughs> 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 
Later, we black his coffee. <laughs> Retreat! It tastes more bitter than blackest coffee. I won't let this go to my head. I cannot grow complacent. This will help me break new boundaries. I've grasped new strength. 